Hola niños, bienvenidos a nuestra clase. Welcome to our class. Hey kids, this is Miss Hernandez. Are you ready for some math? Let's get started. Today we're talking about 2D shapes. Ready? A Shape Scavenger Hunt by Carrie Dinmont. Shapes are everywhere. Everything around us has a shape. Turn the page to see if you can find the different shapes in this book. Some shapes have straight sides. Triangles have three straight sides. All sides may be the same length or the sides may be different lengths. Some road signs are shaped like triangles. How many triangles are on these sailboats? Squares have four sides. Each side is the same length. Rectangles have four sides too. Rectangles have two short sides and two long sides. The opposite sides of the rectangle are the same length. How many square windows can you find in this photo? Diamonds also have four sides. Their sides are the same length. Diamonds are like squares that lean or slant to one side. Two triangles can make a diamond. Kites are often shaped like diamonds. Which field is shaped like a diamond? Some shapes have many sides. Octagons have eight sides. Each side is the same length. Can you find the octagon in this photo? A star is another common shape. Stars have five or more points. Which of these flags have stars? Some shapes are round. A circle is made of one line that curves around. All points on the line are the same distance from the center of the circle. Ovals are also round. They're like squash circles. Can you find the circles in this parking lot? Hearts also have two sides. If you draw a line down the center, the two halves are like a mirror image. Each half starts at the top of the line. It curves up and away from the line. Then it comes back down towards the line. It meets the other side at the same point at the bottom. Which candy is shaped like a heart? A crescent has two sides. Both sides are curved. A crescent looks like a sliver of a circle. Sometimes the moon is shaped like a crescent. Which food is shaped like a crescent? The world around us is made of shapes. There are many kinds of shapes. What shapes do you see in this kitchen? Yes, that is correct. You see those shapes in this kitchen. It's time for us to review our 2D shapes. Triangle. It has three sides, three corners or vertices, and three angles. Square. It has four equal sides, four corners or vertices, and four right angles. A rectangle has four sides. Two of them are short, and two are long. It has four vertices and four right angles. Circle it has zero sides and zero vertices. A trapezoid has four sides, two of them are equal, and it has four vertices and four angles. A rhombus has four equal sides, four vertices and four angles. Finally, a hexagon. It has six sides, six vertices, and six angles. Now that we have reviewed our 2D shapes, we can create new shapes with those shapes that we talked about. 
you can use 2D shapes to create other 2D shapes. For example, we can use four squares. If we put them together, side by side, we can make one rectangle. Or if we use two small triangles and we put them next to each other, we can make a big triangle. Okay, boys and girls, now it's your turn. Can you decompose my shapes? This one is a square. What other 2D shapes can you make from this one? If you make one line down, you can get two rectangles. If you make a cross in the middle of the square, you can make four smaller squares. Or if you make an X in the middle of the square, you can get four different triangles. Now it's your turn to decompose the following shapes. Remember, composing is to put together and decomposing is to take apart. Take pictures of your work and let me see what you come up with. Thank you!